what is going on everybody it's your boy king graves i hope everyone's doing well and i hope everybody had a great thanksgiving listen i still got this weird cough i don't know what's going on but i took a little break i had some stuff uh backlogged for you guys i put that out um and once again thank you everybody who's been watching uh, make sure you subscribe, make sure you hit the bell notification when I'm posting new videos, make sure you like the video and join the Discord community, um, I've said that before because we'll be talking everything Marvel Rivals, we'll be making some Marvel Rivals channels, uh, I'll be doing that this week, but yeah man, we're going to be doing a lot of crazy stuff, but we got the official launch trailer, did I see some of it? Yes, did I see all of it? No, but I wanted to record it, uh, my reaction and talk to you guys about maybe some of the characters we've seen um, or that we are going to see, and I think this week we'll be doing some more like uh, top character list that i want on, or top characters that i want on there but without further ado man let's hop into this sorry if you hear me sniffling like i said i'm, I'm fighting a little something i think it's allergies or something but let's get into it interesting song All right, Iron Fist and Black Widow. Sorry, this is going for, okay. Cloak and Dagger and Squirrel Girl and Wolf, my boy, Wolverine, my boy. Okay. The Hydra facility, I guess. Avengers. I don't know what that team would be called. Got the two dunes. Is that a team up? Alright, hold on. Is that a team up? This must is this a team up? I don't know if this is a team up. Oh, fastball special. Okay, okay, okay. All right, y'all. Interesting stuff, interesting stuff. I I knew, like I said, I knew we were going to get maybe Wolverine or somebody, but um, I was not expecting them to give him, give us him in like a trailer like this. I thought they were going to do it a uh, single person at a single time, but this is pretty cool. I guess release date's coming up. It's going to be Friday, um, whenever you guys are listening to this. Uh, I think December 6th. So... You're trying to probably ramp it up. Um, and sorry if you guys see stuff in the back. We're getting ready for Christmas and whatnot. There's a whole bunch of stuff going on. We're moving some stuff. But very, very interesting. We're going to be hopping into this like frame by frame here. Because I just kind of want to break down some stuff. Um, this whole Galactus female thing, I'm a little lost. A little lost, but we'll see where it goes. I don't know. Maybe she's her own Galactus. Like Maybe there's another one. We'll see the storyline. I have no idea. I have I don't really know much about her. I don't know what's going on with that. Um, Psylocke, which we've seen. We also got a new character art. We're also going to do a video where we're talking about all the character arts as well. Um, probably our favorite ones, the, the ones that we want to see, um, and ones that we haven't gotten yet, and etc. We're going to be doing that as well. We'll do some of those videos. Moon Knight, which we've seen. We did a video on him as well, which is pretty cool. Iron Fist, interesting very interesting i need to see some gameplay footage of him fighting because he, he's mostly hand-to-hand -hand combat he doesn't really have any weapons there was a time where like he had some guns at some point in time and it was kind of like a gun fu thing um but i don't know other than that that's usually all he uses is his fists i don't ever see him having a weapon could be wrong but to my marvel now just not what happened i really am intrigued by his design here and i also i'm wondering if it's danny Rand. Um, if it is Danny, that's interesting. If it's a different Iron Fist, that's also interesting because I would love to know the history about that as well. Very interesting costume, though, guys. Kind of cool, kind of cool. I'm wondering if we'll have some different versions of it. I like it, I like it, I like it. It's a little different, but I definitely like it a lot. Of course, we got Hawkeye. We talked about him before. A lot of people are hating on this skin. I really like this Hawkeye skin. Like, Hawkeye is like, you know, great shot. Man is pretty much like an assassin. It's kind of like his Ronin persona mixed with his Hawkeye costume, if that makes sense. That that's and I just thought of that. That makes a lot of sense to me, and I really enjoy that. 
Yeah, he's pretty cool. And then, of course, we get Black Widow. So she has more of a futuristic tech like him. I'm wondering if this is her base costume or if it's the... Uh, they're doing a lot of, like, Wakanda, Vibranium, Battle Armor. Um, like, I guess when other people come from different planets or universes in the storyline, uh, T'Challa finds them or something like that, and they gear them up for the fight ahead, which is pretty cool. But that we kind of got the hint from uh, that we were going to get... Um, black widow because it was on the hydra statue geez sorry guys like i said my nose is a little stuffy so we're struggling but um we kind of had a hint at her coming in so we kind of knew she was coming which is interesting this one let me get a closer look this one's the most interesting let's see if we can yep we're getting cloak and dagger and cloak and dagger if you guys don't know they've they've kind of come to the forefront a little bit um, they're definitely like C-list characters in Marvel, but they have their own show on Freeform, which was pretty good. I didn't mind it. It was very CW-esque. It was okay. It wasn't great. Um, and then, of, of course, they've been in like uh, the Miles Morales comics as well. I forget the name. It's not the New Defenders. It was called like Street Warriors or something like that. Some Warriors. Um, and I think they had them more or less in there. I think it was like Kamala Khan, uh, Miles, Cloak and Dagger. And then there was like one other person. I'll have to show it on the screen or something. But interesting that they're bringing them in that's something i didn't think would happen i i don't understand how it's going to work and we would have to see more gameplay footage because it seems like they're going to play as one character so i don't know if you'll be switching uh, you know back and forth like you'll be tagging someone in or you know maybe you're just cloak and dagger is your assist person or maybe you're just dagger and cloaks your assist person that'd be very interesting to look at as well man has a big old gaping hole in his chest i guess he's just straight smoke all the time that's why i think maybe she's going to be the one we play as and he will be the one assisting you um how that works though for ultimates will be interesting because you can do team up ultimates with people so are they both going to be do working with them i don't know but interesting design also he has more she has more of a tech costume as well um and then of course he has change on his side look like my man has some dreads so it's very interesting very interesting squirrel. of course we get squirrel girl not much i can say about her i know she was introduced like it probably uh two, 2010 maybe a little later um at some point in time but pretty much squirrel girl imagine spider-man but squirrel girl like there's not much i can say about her i don't know too much about her origin because i kind of saw her and kind of just ignored it but uh, i think she was also in like the something warriors as well so um very interested to see how she plays i would imagine she's going to play like maybe a junk rat character especially since she has a slingshot so it seems like she's gonna be slingshotting things at people i don't know pretty interesting that's fine kind of cool though but like her uh cons her costume's less tech i feel like all these costumes that have been coming out have been like high tech costume but hers seems like yeah nothing crazy still regular but hers seems like a regular and my boy let me finish my thought hers seems like a regular costume and and, a, and like just regular stuff which is pretty cool but wolverine man man this is my guy. If you guys don't know, I am a big Wolverine fan. It's my favorite Marvel hero besides Warpath. Um, if you guys don't know who Warpath is, he's like a Native American. He kind of has the same healing factors as Wolverine and everything. He was in the Weapon X program as well. He's really, really cool. But Wolverine, the fact that they showed him like this is kind of cool. His costume's interesting. I'm going to wheel it back a little bit. Real big shoulder pads kind of giving me, I don't know. It doesn't, it's not like a costume we've ever seen. It just seems like a, a X-Men jacket. So I kind of like that this game is taking their own liberty to making new and, and uh, fresh costumes and the ones that we haven't seen, but they will be bringing like other costumes in there for ones we have seen in the comics, and etc. But pretty cool, man. I do like the extra mutton chops though. The man, yeah, that's cool. That's cool. Very, very anime-like. A lot of these characters, very anime-like. But yeah, this man's jacket is interesting. I don't know if I'm in love with this costume. I don't know. Very interesting. But it seems like we have like the X-Men team here. Um, Namor? I don't really remember him being on the X-Men. But uh, we, could, we could do some research on that. We can see. But very interesting. This, I, like I said, I don't know. It's kind of throwing me for a loop. It's, it's cool. Because they're taking hints from his like actual costume and just putting it into a jacket. And I know he does have some jackets like that. But I don't know. I don't know. I feel like we could have got a Wolverine costume. But I do like this. Every X-Men in here, which is really cool. Um, what other teams do we have? Because we were talking about that. Of course, we get the Avengers look. Nice that they put Bucky on the Avengers team. And this is like their classic 360, you know, Avengers Assemble. 
picture. The cap costume is still interesting. Very high tech. Very high tech. I feel like the base costumes could have just been like more like Bucky's, like more chill. Like this dude feels like a galactic hero. I think he could have just had a regular uh, Captain America costume. Black Widow and Hawkeye, I kind of understand. But once again, they took their own liberties to do their own thing, which is pretty cool. Squirrel Girl's costume, like we said, pretty, pretty regular, pretty basic. And our man Jeff, wild, wild. I still don't understand his whole thing, but man, it's just a mutant shark or something crazy. This is kind of cool. So they're like their own team as well. And I'm wondering if this is foreshadowing for people who can team up with each other, just like the X-Men, just like the Avengers um, and this team. I don't know what you would want to call this team. This definitely isn't the Marvel Knights. Um, definitely isn't no East Coast Avenger or anything else like that. Or the Defenders, maybe? I don't know. I've never seen this team before. I'd have to Google it. But I know Moon Knight has run in with the Punisher before. I don't know about Cloak and Dagger. That's kind of sick. That's really cool. But we'll say the graphics in this game. Oh, man. Look at that. Woo! That could be a screensaver if anyone ever made one. And then, of course, we get Doom, the two Dooms, which is pretty cool. We get Spider-Man. Uh, looks like a team-up shot. Like, maybe she grabs one of his and creates, like, a bomb out of it. Interesting. Interesting. And then, of course, we got Magic and we got Psylocke. That looks like another team-up moment as well, which is pretty cool. I'm wondering if maybe she can... I don't know. Maybe she could teleport her further across the map or something. Not quite sure. And then we get Hawkeye and Black Widow. Like, and the, but there's not a lot of stuff on screen that we can tell if there's anything happening, but maybe they do a barrage shot or something. That looks like maybe that's what's happening here. I don't know. And she has like a rail gun. Okay. So she has a rail gun, not like a real gun or anything. Cause we do have Punisher and that's his type of gun and stuff. So I'm and, um, Bucky. So I'm wondering how they're going to balance that out as well. But see, this is what I mean. I wonder if she's just going to, if he's going to be lurking over her and he's going to be her assist character when you play as a dagger, but huh? And then of course there's moon Knight, So that cancels. And that looks like maybe you can cancel out ultimates from other ultimates still not a lot of news on that either and then of course we have uh Kanchu Singh but the best one of all you get Hulk and Wolverine Iron Fist does look pretty sick too oh man and I forget her name but ah, I'm not too worried about that character I'm not gonna lie they brought her in for Marvel Strike Force but that looks sick and then Hulk's thing looks sick too but the fast ball special the fact that they brought that into this game I'm very curious on how that's going to work um, and recent games, we have like Berserker's Barrage, which is just Wolverine, like randomly slashing, uh, nonstop, but this looks pretty cool. We're going to take a deeper look at it. I just want to see what this looks like for here. Yeah. It seems like he's going to be like, you throw him down a lane, probably. And he just starts slashing up characters is what it seems like it's going to be. Not, I don't mind his like, uh, character design. Though. His character design looks really good, but Hey man, Marvel rivals. It's looking great. It's looking great. Like I said, we'll be having more videos coming out through the week all the way up until the release. And we will be streaming when this game releases as well. So get ready for that. Like I said, subscribe, hit the bell notification when I post new videos and hop into the Discord. We'll be playing Marvel Rivals with anybody and everybody if you want to play. If you don't have someone to play with, feel free to hop on in. We will be playing. Somebody will probably be in there and want to play with you as well. But all this stuff looks pretty sick i feel like we're going to get more characters that are releasing very soon um and there's other information that's going to be coming out as well and some information that i've been stockpiling so maybe we'll be doing an update as well like maybe on wednesday i'll be giving you some of the news i've been getting um as far as maps as far as the roadmap we even though we did two roadmap videos but there's stuff that uh, was said behind the scenes that have been popping up on twitter and discord but we'll definitely be doing that but hey guys that is it for your boy wish me luck i don't know what this cough is my nose is stuffy I I just think it's because we had the heat on in here, but hey, I'll catch you on the next one.